As air commander of the Decepticon attack forces and arguably one of their most lethal warriors, Starscream sees himself as a hero on the wrong side. Over the centuries he's come to believe both Optimus and Megatron have lost sight of what is best for the Cybertronian race, and simply pursue their own agendas. Even though he has been loyal to the latter, he disagreed with Megatron's obsession with the AllSpark and decided that, for the greater good of their species, a new leader should emerge. Transformers Movie 1 Star Scream was lying in wait at a U.S. air base when covert agent Frenzy reported that the AllSpark had been located, along with Megatron, underneath Hoover Dam. Though he had long feared this day would come, Star Scream ordered the rest of the Decepticons to mobilize. The others responded, with Blackout trallying in the name of Megatron. The first to arrive, Starscream attacked the hydroelectric power plant attached to the dam to cause havoc to Sector 7's operations and to speed the thawing of Megatron. With friends and sabotage, Megatron quickly broke free of his icy restraints and escaped the facility. He almost immediately met with the waiting Starscream, who pledged his loyalty to Megatron, demanding to know what had happened to the AllSpark. Megatron was told by his second in command that it was now in the possession of the humans. Furious, Megatron berated his lieutenant for yet another failure. What a warm reunion. During the assault on a nearby city, Starscream fooled Captain Lennox's unit by posing as an F-22 Raptor providing cover. Starscream launched an attack that crippled Bumblebee as Ironhide realized too late who the fighter really was. As Sam Witwicky ran with the AllSpark, Starscream swooped down, blocking his path, only to be attacked by both Ironhide and Ratchet. After fighting without much effort, but still besting them, Starscream took to the skies again, instead of securing the AllSpark from the now defenseless Sam. While Megatron attempted to retrieve the AllSpark from Sam, Starscream perched on nearby buildings and shot down an army Black Hawk helicopter when it attempted to help the human evacuate the cube. Eventually, real F-22 Raptors from the US Air Force arrived, and Starscream disguised himself, pretending to be a part of their squadron. Starscream surprised the human pilots by transforming in midair and destroying three of the Raptors before he was fired upon. He transformed back into his disguise and fled, and was not seen in the closing moments of the battle between Optimus Prime and Megatron. Most of the Decepticons were defeated, and their bodies cast into the deepest part of the ocean. Ultimately, Starscream retreated from Earth to Partsa and with intentions in unknown.